Hey there peoples, be right here again from Quarantine Gaming with my next part of my let's play of The Walking Dead. So let's um jump straight back in after breaking out of the freezer fridge that they was keeping us in, ready to um cut us up and eat us or trade us off for food or whatever they've been doing with us. And see if we can go and rescue the other part of the group that was kept somewhere else. So let's go. So I'm assuming they're going to be in the house after uh, Kenny ran off. I did say a storm was coming. I swear I've seen a body on the other side. legs and tried to feed them to us shit is everyone else okay they've still got duck and Katja in the house and i don't know where the fuck kenny is all right we're coming in to help the main gate is too dangerous go around the fence and see if there's a back way in i'll keep looking for kenny do you have a weapon i don't leave home without it ben stick close and lee be careful Fairly big house to go uh, snooping around. Should have gone back for the taser. Yeah, she did. She shot me. <laughs> she wasn't lying, was she? Let's open this door. At least I know when she says stop. A best stop. Come on now, you know you don't want to do this. I did. I didn't move again. God damn it. Take three. Sorry about guys, watching the same thing over again. Not something you come here to do. So I'll make sure I don't, I'll try and make sure I don't die this time. What meant to do? Where am I meant to go? Just 
waiting for somebody. Can I go back? I can't go back or anything. It's only letting me go forward, but she'll just shoot me in the head again. See, I can't, I can't go in. Right, I mustn't go in the house then. Can I back up? Right. There's no other option there. There's no other option. I've got to open the screen door. Right, so I can't take any more steps because she just fucking blows my head off. There's no. There's no help or anything. There's no buttons to press. Can't go backwards. Can't go. All I can do is go forwards, but. She just shoots me. Move when she's not looking. How I do it? I don't know. I'll try. I'm trying that. Every time she looks down, I'll take a little step. It's the only way I can. Just make sure there's still nothing. There's nothing for me to do. Nothing. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Can't even like throw anything at her or Closer or not, I can't. I can't work it out. Stop right there, I mean it. Oh, I told you to stop. I did. I did stop. God damn it. Right. Definitely no no other option here. Please, please don't you take another step. Brit, come on now, you know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Stop right there, I mean it. Ah, there we go. Think about what you do. It doesn't have to end like this. Ah, look, walk her up there. Stay back! Don't do anything stupid! Ah, oh, right. I know what it is. It's because I touched. I was touching the pad. This time. Easy peasy. Sorry, guys. Apologies for all these deaths. After shocking, I am. We'll just muddle on through. Please, please don't you take another step. Brit, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away and leave us be. Right, walkie, walkie, walkie. Stop Let go. There, I mean it. 
Alright. Speak swim. Put the gun down, bitch. Don't say that to her then. Ah, oh. <laughs> they moved it. <laughs> they moved the questions. Take four hundred and eighty-two. Go, Brenda. Brenda, come on now. You know you don't want to do this. Just go away. Think about what you do. It doesn't have to end like this. I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. Stay back! Don't do anything stupid! Let her go, Brenda. Please, listen to him. I'll do it! Please! I think she would do it after shooting me 14 times. I don't want to kill you, Lee. Please don't make this any worse. Don't make it any worse. Just stop. Can you grab her yet? Lee, use your strong hand. I'm gonna hit him with one of these fences now. Oh. Come on, Carly, with that gun again. Pop his head. Uh, come on. Thank fuck for that. Right up, left up, right up, left up, Whoosh. left up.
He's had enough. Is that all you got, Lee? <laughs> you ain't shit! It's over! Fuck you! As soon as Dan and Mama get out here, you you all fucked! <laughs> They're both dead. What did you do? What the fuck did you do? Please. Don't you dare walk away from me, Lee! Get back here and finish this, Lee! Oh, don't kill him off. Walk away. No, you kill this son of a bitch off. Kill or be killed nowadays. Well, guess this dairy farm isn't that safe, really. Lost two people coming here. Didn't even get fed. So that's a lot of rubbish. But the bandits are still out there, I suppose. Back to the motel. So that's why we're heading. Hey Lee, I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended. But, you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? Yeah. And Clementine almost ate some. But? I stopped her. I can't leave her alone, Carly. This fucking world now. It's hiding just unspeakable shit at every turn. Katya managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. Yeah. <sighs> How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hun, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. Hmm. There's gonna be fallout. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. What do you think? You know, hero, you destroyed two lives in that meat locker. Yeah, we did. Hey, you're not a bad what the hell are we gonna do now? Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Lee, did you have to kill those men? Yeah. Yes, they were bad men, Clementine. They killed Mark and they were gonna kill all of us. They had to be stopped. Understand? Yes, I think so. Hey, Dad, what's that noise? Sounds like a car. Oh, God, 
Not more strangers. <laughs> it looks too easy to just go and take. Oh crap. Baby, you gotta see this. It's a shitload of food and supplies back here. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, we don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. Well, what if it's not? Well, what if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? Have to take it? We have to take this, Clementine. We need it to survive. I'm sorry, sweetheart, but it's not about right and wrong anymore. It's about survival. Yeah, you have to take it. Right, I'm going to call it there just because I died so many times in this episode. It'll drag on a little bit longer. Um, again, apologies for the deaths, but I got there in the end. It took a while. Um, so we've broke away from the dairy farm. I think we're making our way back to the motel. Hopefully that'll still be standing. On the way, found this car full of food. So I'll tune back in next time for my next part. Find out how much of this food we can carry, because obviously the car's not working. Is the motel still standing? And where we end up from here. Also check out the channel, subscribe, give us some like on there. Like the channel, subscribe to it. Check out the videos from the other QG lads. And I will catch all you guys soon. Peace.